In this lecture, we'll learn about the display property utility. You can easily change an element's display property with a simple use of some classes. The display property can be changed to block, inline, and inline block. First, we'll create a div block element, which we'll change into an inline element. We use the class dInline. And for this example, we'll also use the class BG primary for the background color so we can see the difference. We will duplicate the element so we can easily see the effect in the browser. They are right next to each other. To make it a block element, we'll change the class to dBlock. We can see it jumps down under the first element acting as a block element. To show you how the D inline block class will affect an element, I will just change the markup a bit and add a little more content. Finally, the class on the parent elements will be changed to D inline block. As we can see, it looks right. We have now learned how to use the display property utility. Go on and continue with the coding exercise, which will help you learn the correct structure for this utility. In the next lecture, we'll learn about the Flexbox utility.